Phoenix, Arizona's 20-mile-long Metro Rail Line opens December 27, 2008. The system connects the desert cities of Phoenix, Tempe, and Mesa. Nearly the entire length of the track runs parallel with street traffic. The result is havoc. Local drivers aren't used to sharing the road with the train. January 5th, 2009. Mesa resident Brandon Stovall and his girlfriend are in the process of moving. After the eastbound train passes, the crossing arm raises up. Brandon pulls onto the tracks, oblivious to the oncoming westbound train. Moving at 25 miles per hour, there's no way the train can stop in time. The train rips through the bed of the truck, sending furniture flying. The vehicle swings 180 degrees before coming to a stop. There's no movement inside the cab of the pickup. Bystanders check on the couple. Moments later, Brandon and his girlfriend are able to walk away, but their truck is destroyed. Had Brandon driven any slower, the collision could have been fatal. To help prevent further accidents, the Phoenix Metro has spent millions upgrading warning systems, adding curbs between trains and cars, and educating the public.